hello guys in this lesson we will start to design the proportion control on reference tracking problem okay and so uh, in order to obtain the proportional control design we need to create the closed loop diagram closed loop diagram with some reference what's that mean it means that we need to use the sum reference to drive the system to it okay and so in order to decrease the error value between the reference and the state variable and then we need to create the closed loop diagram but in where in tf mode okay because our system is linear and so we can use or utilize the tf mode or transfer from function mode in here okay and so <coughs> if we have some kind of system like this one one divided by i x times s square plus g x times s okay and so if we have this kind of system which is the plant we named it as a plant we can use the summary of the g s value okay and so if we use the proportional control design and so we need to add some gain factor in here like this one kp and so how can we fed to kp value in here in order to decrease or minimize the error in this settings and so we need to measure the sum value on this diagram like this one h s h s means that it's a measurement values or it's a converter for a sensor or any thermocouple or the current sensor okay and so it has a dynamics and then uh, it means that it has the specific dynamic relation in your own or in its own structure okay and so hs gives us a plant model for the sensor device okay and so if we have some kind of information in here and so we need to collect the whole the term in that position like this one if we have such x ref s value in here in the transfer fund or in the laplace domain because the everything should be included in the laplace domain and so we can obtain the error value by using this block okay and so this means that this is the error s and so this is the us okay this is the input value input this is a plant this is a sensor this is a controller or cs okay but how can we obtain this diagram this diagram is named with the closed loop control because we use the sensor to get the information from the system such as the xs was given in here because the output of our system is equal to the xs okay and so xs is fed into the, the computer and so the xref minus xs creates the error value and so if we have a sum specific proportional factor in here and then we can create the us okay this is our main purpose of to creating the proportional control but where the reference tracking problem
problem. What about stability of these things? If you don't have the any variable, which is the reference signal on this plant, and so our problem turns into the stability. Stability. I cannot write it. I corrected it. Like this one, stability condition. Okay. And so we have the X ref signal in here. We don't have the X ref signal in here. But we can use these terms as a basis for controlling this system. And so in control theory, there are two approaches to be conditioned the system. The forward is the stability condition, which means that the system goes to zero in time, okay, or bounded region. But in the second place, or the latter condition, is the reference tracking problem, which is used by driving the system to any point or in terminology desired point okay and so if we have used the closed loop control and then sensor should be added in here but we may also use the open loop control and so in this case there is no sensor in here okay these are based of the proportion control design and then we need to build uh, this diagram or the block diagram in order to obtain the total form or the closed loop form of this transfer function okay and so how can we obtain the total transfer function and so what about the or the what is the parameter on the input variable or the output variable so our title should be updated like this one and so in the previous case we define the error signal in here like this one es is equal to the what es is equal to the x ref s minus x s okay and so es times kp times gs which is the plant and so creates the xs from the second block diagram because the x ref minus xs creates es and so es times kp times gs is equal to the xs okay and so we can drive this signal or we can use this two equation in order to create a reference tracking problem and so es can be written by the xr minus x <coughs> times kp times g is equal to the x s is removed in here for the simplicity of the equation okay but everything has the s or the laplace position domain okay and so we can use the math in order to reorganize this equation like this one xr times kp times g must be equal to the this term is putting into the right hand side and so x1 plus kp times g okay and so what about the input of our system in the normal position the input of our system is the input value or the action or the torque value or the force value but in the reference tracking problem in order to use the proportion control design and so we need to obtain the x divided by xr because we need to equalize this two term at the t goes to the infinity okay and so if we have this kind of information in here and so we can write it down as kp times g divided by one plus kp g is the total closed loop transfer function transfer function okay these are general notation <coughs> to create a proportional control in here okay and so 
what's the condition of the proportional control? In this case, the error S or ET in time domain must be going to do zero. Okay? ET is going to zero. Then T goes to infinity. Okay? And so ET is created by the X reference minus XS and so XR and XS should be equal to each other. And so the general main condition is that XS, XRS should be equal to zero for perfect controller design. Okay? <coughs> this is the same technique with the designing the PD control or PID control or full state feedback control or any control mechanism in nonlinear or time time invariant and so okay and so this is the basic rule that we should satisfy in this notation and so how can we satisfy it and so we can select the proper proportional factor for the P controller or proportional coefficients okay in the next lesson we will discuss about it okay <coughs>